Hello, Judo family. Welcome to a lovely evening here in Tennessee. Let me know if you guys can uh, hear and see me okay. Hey, Cindy. Hey, Cynthia. Good to see you. Am I coming through okay? All right. How's everybody doing this evening? Hey, Kami. Little Dupe, Frank. I see you guys. York, PA. PA again. Callie, Antique Gamer, Tater, I see it. What's up, guys? Hey, Sherry. Columbus, Ohio. I'll be making my way up there shortly to do some playing. Hey, Anna. When's Vegas again? Corn just got back from Vegas again. I just went down there and played in a uh, slot tournament. Hi, Shauna. It, it is beautiful out here, Patricia. That's why I wanted to share it all with you guys out here in Tennessee. Mount Pleasant, Michigan. Evening, Jonathan. Linda. So we'll let uh, a few more people join. Going to be covering a lot of info uh, here tonight. Guys from Phoenix. Not sure when I'm going to make it to Phoenix. Hopefully sometime this year. Uh, I've got lots of plans coming up. Hey, Emmy and Lillian. Good to see you guys. See you shortly in, in AC for another epic group pool. Hey, Lisa. Cat. Hey, brother, Brian. Yep, it is a beautiful day here in Tennessee. So, uh, hey, Rob. So, if you guys uh, haven't caught on yet, the, the videos have been dropping on Tuesday evenings. So, uh, once a week, every Tuesday evening is when a new video comes out. Um, and eventually, we will... Uh, hey, welcome to the family, Tex. Uh, eventually, we'll get to the point where we're dropping two videos a week. Uh, until until we get to that point, I thought maybe I would just do uh, like a live hangout on Thursday night. So we'll have a video on Tuesday nights and a, and a live on Thursday, unless I'm gambling somewhere, and then I'll try to stream the, the gambling session live for you guys on Thursdays. So videos on Tuesdays, lives on Thursdays, uh, until we get to two videos a week. Uh, and then, of course, we'll get to three videos a week, and then we'll get to a, you know, a new video a day once we get to that point. So right now, it's just it takes me a while to travel because Vegas is a uh, four-hour flight. Hey, Kerry. Snowflake, Arizona. Vic, welcome to the extended family. <laughs> Karen, <laughs> yeah, I, I, Livy's all paid up. She gets paid in, in uh, dinners and lunches and all kinds of other good stuff. <laughs> yes, it is, Lisa. Even a JJ. Hey, Kirsten, I'm so glad you can make it. Uh, Windstar is going to be coming up soon. Uh, guys, I've got my father flying in from Spain. He's retired in Spain, uh, and he's flying in the end of June. And uh, we're gonna we're going to uh, go to Vegas. We're going to uh, go to California. I'm gonna play at Yamava, and we're gonna visit his dad in California. And then, uh, hey Fred, and then we're going to uh, fly up to Washington State and visit my sister, and uh, probably drive back from Washington State and just do a tour, and we'll stop at Windstar on the way home. Pittsburgh in the house. Hey Rhonda. Scott, doing good, brother. Just tired. Lots of lots of trips. Lots of lots and lots of gambling. Uh, so, uh, oh, Adam and Ashley, uh, four wins. Uh, it's four wins in Indiana, I think. So, uh, thanks, Kerry. Cheesehead, glad you made it, brother. Um, so, yeah, guys, I have I have like seven or eight videos loaded up in the drive right now, just waiting to be released from. Uh, uh, all these Vegas trips. So uh, the the one trip, the 25th through the 28th, I think it was. Uh, there was four videos on that trip. I had to split the first day into two two videos, and then we've got day two and day three. So there's four total videos. We still have one more video coming out just from that trip. Um. So yeah, lots and lots of uh, jackpots. Uh, Cat, yes, I have officially uh, quit my job. 
so I'm doing YouTube full time for you guys now and just traveling and, and making videos. Uh, so that was a very nerve wracking decision of uh, being in a management position for years and years and years and years and leaving that to try something new, uh, which is YouTube. Uh, and it's just been an amazing, amazing journey. And I, and I hope it just continues to, to be amazing for you guys. Like I said, I'd like to get to the uh, two videos a day or uh, two videos a week then three and then a video a day and get to you know like some of these other guys like Vegas Matt who I just got to sit down and have drinks with um, this uh, last trip the 25th through the 28th where, where we sat down and had some drinks and then went out and played on the floor and and that's all he does him and EJ they go out there and they just they make uh, uh, several several videos a day actually he <laughs> so, uh, I do plan to go to Tunica shortly as well hopefully this year Richard so thank you very much blessed uh, Kat, yeah, it was definitely a very hard decision going from something that's known uh, where you're, you're programmed your whole life, you know, work nine to five, five days a week, and et cetera, et cetera, to, to try something completely new and different. So, so Ginger's in the house. So, what's up, unlucky Ginger? So, uh, I'll call you after this live because I need to come hang out with you down there. We've got some, some plans we want to do. Uh, Mickey, thank you. I appreciate it. Uh, Blue Chip, Michigan. Congrats. Thanks, Sonia. I'm trying to catch up on all the, the videos, guys. Uh, I saw the comment about the wife. Don't worry about that, guys. I'm going to clear all that up in this video. Hey, Richard. Uh, thanks very much, T Day. Lewis, appreciate you. Rodriguez, uh, don't change your style. It makes you, it's what makes you you. Mac, yeah, I can only be who I am. So it's just, uh, um, it's, it's my favorite part is meeting all the judo family while I'm out playing and uh, just playing with everybody and, and having and having a blast. So uh, and you guys can talk to all the people that come and watch me play live. And Octavius, I see you, brother. Uh, I do too. New day. I wish they would uh, allow recording of Harris Cherokee. I really love that casino, but uh, we've tried. We've been in touch with them. Uh, they just they they're adamant uh, and they've drawn a line. They will not allow any recording there. So uh, Fred, I will make it back to Laburge. Thank you very much, Barbara. Appreciate it. So, but this was my idea, guys, that uh, since we're releasing videos once a week, every Tuesday evening, that I'll start doing a live stream just to hang out with the judo family. I missed you guys on Thursdays, uh, unless I'm out gambling somewhere. And then as long as I got permission, I'll live stream the gambling for you. So I am coming to Arizona, random. Uh, Janice's life. How long did it take you to make profit throughout your gambling life? I love your videos. I lived to Lake Charles. Love that video. Uh, Janice, that's a great question. So, guys, so not nearly as profitable gambling now that I've started a YouTube channel as I was when I was just playing on my own gambling. Because if you watch my videos, you'll see me go into a casino, sit down on a machine, and bang, hit a $11,000, $12,000 jackpot in like 10 minutes. Normally, that would be it for me. I would cash out. And, hey, I just made 10 grand in five minutes. I'm done. But now that I'm making content for you guys, it's, I got to have more than, you know, five to 10 minutes for the video. So I have to sit there and keep playing. And of course, gambling is gambling. The odds are always stacked in, uh, against you. And the longer you play, the better the odds are that you're going to give money back to the house and, and they're going to get their money back. So I, I, I'm still profitable, uh, but not nearly as much profitable uh, gambling now that I'm actually making videos because it's a whole different thing. Because now you know, I'm making these hour long videos and uh, normally I'd hit those jackpots and that's it. I'm taking my money and I'm, I'm, I'm running. So, uh, what's up, Chris, Florida in, uh, beginning of June. So we're, we're coming down to play brother. Uh, definitely coming to Arizona, Carrie. So thank you, Melinda. I'm an hour from Reno. Yep. Uh, I'm going to be doing Reno Lake Tahoe too. Also. Uh, yeah, we still have one more video coming out, uh, Richard, from that three-day trip in Vegas, and we did like four mini group pulls on that uh, on that video, and, and we smashed every one. So uh, we won on every one of them, and, and uh, won a big one on the very last one at the end of the night. Hey, Patty, one of our VIP members. I see you, Patty. How'd you do it, Bingo? Uh, Vegas, June 6th through the 10th no I think I will probably I'm planning Florida around that time uh, Vegas at the end of July yes uh, somewhere around the end of July I think I'm planning I haven't got all the dates worked out yet with my father flying in um, oh, sorry to hear it Patty we need to hook up and go do some playing together 
So, hello, Sharon. Looking forward to it. Uh, double, where can we get notified when you're going to a certain state? I'm also Arizona. I post all that info for members on the channel uh, under community uh, for members only to see that I'll be going here on these dates or there on those dates. Uh, and, and the only reason I do that is I can't post that I'm going to Arizona on this date for all of our subscribers and then have hundreds and hundreds of people show up uh, at the casino. Will you be introducing your father to the rest of the family? Yeah, he's uh, he's he's going to be, he wants to be my security detail. So, but uh, he's never hit a jackpot on Buffalo. So I'm going to go show him how it's done when he gets in. And yeah, I'll get him on camera for you guys. Judo Sr. Hello from Hawaii. Hi, Patricia. Yeah, Patty, we'll take care of that. We'll, we'll definitely take care of that. Chica Bonita Grand. Nice, Patricia. How, how much was it? So yeah, Mac, that's that's the, the the ultimate goal is I'd like to do a video a day for you guys, get to that point, uh, and probably eventually relocate if the channel continues uh, uh, going in the right direction and the channel does really well, maybe relocate to Vegas where I can actually do a video a day. Right now I'm in Tennessee and it's I got to catch a flight. Uh, so I just did a great video for you guys this last trip where I did the whole behind the se uh, behind the scenes footage for you guys, like what it takes for me to go do a gambling video for you guys. Uh, from the airport to checking into a hotel to being at the airport to landing in Vegas to the limo ride out to the property in the hotel room So yeah, no Buffalo tat yet Patty. It's I got to hit a big one for that. Hey Kurt. Welcome to the immediate family, brother Hey Gary. Hello from Colorado So uh, yeah, I did uh, TK's garage. Yeah, I did some some uh, some great videos for you this last trip. We uh, We went out uh, actually Lucinda's idea so she had fantastic ideas and she filmed the whole thing for me. We went out to uh, uh, slots of fun at Circus Circus and did coin operated slots. And I did a whole video on uh, playing coin slot machines uh, and we had an absolute blast. You're gonna, gonna love that video, it was fun. Except for when we broke the machine and they had to come refill it with coins because I hit the cash out button. No, stop it, Ginger, no piggy tattoo. The only way I'm getting a piggy tattoo or a buffalo one is if I hit a, a big grand. Yeah, we'll have to meet up, TK. So lots of stuff to cover. Uh, let's see, uh, Judo Ball is ending this month, the end of this month, drawing the winner live, May 2nd. So we'll get that done and I'll, I'll do a live for May 2nd uh, and get the winner drawn of Judo Ball and uh, I'll call the winner and schedule whatever's a good time frame to go to Vegas uh, that works for the winner. So whatever works for their schedule and we'll set them all up with flights in the rooms and it'll be a whole vip experience and we'll film all that we're picking them up with the limo at the airport and the whole nine yards so that's going to be a lot of fun uh doing well on ainsworth's machines nice gary hey tyner uh james maybe i don't have any business here sorry for commenting i must have missed your comment brother no worries so, thanks kurt i really appreciate you can you just do half hour videos? Uh, I could, Kat, start to, but I mean, I've already got the my team backed up with like seven or eight videos right now waiting to come out. So, I mean, I could go do half hour videos and we just have a bunch. So I need to get the team to the point where they start posting them twice a week. So good luck in Vegas, Adrian. So, yeah, happy Thursday. Wisconsin or Iowa anytime soon. Uh, I do have an offer to go play in Iowa, Deanna. So I just don't know when I'm working in the schedule. I've got uh, so much stuff planned. Uh, definitely going to hit Foxwoods up. Eighteenth of May is my birthday. Right on. Happy early birthday, Jason. I hope you guys kill it at Windstar. Uh, you have any plans to return to Caesar, Southern Indiana? Not really, not not at this point, Jamie. So they don't allow filming there either. So it's uh, it's it's if if I'm gonna go gamble, I'm gonna film for you guys to put content on on the channel so everybody can enjoy it. So uh, uh, I don't want to go play at places that won't let me uh, the film the content for you guys. Nice, good job, pencil. Finally got my judo hat. Nice, Scott. So. Uh, the uh, yeah, yeah, I might come to Iowa just to surprise you, Nick. So um, yeah, I've got uh, on the merchandise stuff, guys. I've got uh, uh, camouflage coming out. 
So I'm really excited about that. That was my personal request. Uh, anything that we offer, shirts, sweaters, hats, any of that stuff, I wanted a camouflage option uh, for all our outdoorsmen and, and women out there. I know we have a lot of, of fans that enjoy the outdoors as much as I do. So I have not played Beau Rivage, Mississippi. I do plan on, on playing in Mississippi. Greg, uh, best chance of winning, the, the most bankroll that you could bring. So the bigger the bankroll you have, the more you can play, the longer you can play, the better the odds are in your favor. Uh, I haven't I haven't actually gone any and done any morel hunting this year. Uh, double diamond, two dollar max bet. How much bankroll would you suggest to try? I I I do like a hundred dollar bankroll for those low low bet machines. So I just dedicate like a hundred dollars to that type of machine, and I'll play a two dollar max bet the whole hundred dollars. Hey, Bill, welcome to uh, the family group pool membership. So we got the group pools in Atlantic City coming at the end of this month. So all, all channel members, you need to make sure you stay up to date on the community tab on YouTube and uh, keep up to date on all that information. Oh, thank you for the super chat, Cynthia. I'll see you in Atlantic City here very soon. Uh, what made you finally quit your job and go full time? Uh, actually, I called the company that I worked for and, and uh, wasn't even planning on quitting right off the bat. I just told them, I said, hey, we need to make plans this year uh, and start looking for a replacement for myself and I'll hang around as long as possible and I'll train the new individual and whatever you guys need me to do I was just giving them a heads up that you know sometime this year I was going to be planning on leaving uh, and they kind of uh, put the throttle down on that and within a couple of weeks they're like okay we need you to go ahead and resign and all that other stuff and uh, and that's how all that went down so left on really good terms I could go back anytime still in contact with all those guys great bunch of guys um, but that's that's exactly how that happened Got two cruises this year. Any advice for cruise ships? Been watching for about two months getting ready. Vic, just look for the right type of games on the cruise ships. So cruise ships follow the same gaming regulations as their, as their home port. Uh, so nothing different on that. Last video was amazing. Thanks, Alan. It was a, uh, it was a wicked trip where, uh, I'm not kidding, almost every single machine I touched was, uh, was, well, I was hitting jackpots on. I think there was like maybe three or four games that I tried uh, that we didn't win on, but almost every single machine that I sat down on, we, we were hitting jackpots or multiple jackpots on. So I think it was like 62 jackpots in three days of playing. It was, it was nuts. So thanks, Scott. Appreciate you, brother. 50,000 on top dollar. That's a heck of a hit. Uh, I have not played at Cushada uh, in Louisiana. I've played at the Golden Nugget and LaBerge is the only two places. And I've also played at uh, one other one right there in Lake Charles. I think it might be a Harris. Uh, Deanna, Huff and More Puff, love that game. I, I hit jackpots on it all the time. Unless you're talking about Huff and Even More Puff, and I haven't had a chance to play that one yet. I don't know if I'm in the judo fan. Laura, I, I, I uh, refer to everyone that's a subscriber of the channel as the judo family. So the memberships are labeled uh, family members, uh, intermediate, extended, family group pools, but everybody's judo fam. So we're building a family community here. Oh, wow, I got to scroll down. I missed a bunch. Is gambling still as fun now that it is more of a job and having to play longer? Uh, yeah, gambling is still a blast to me. I mean, it's it's adult video games. Uh, I, I did uh, uh, I did a great video for you guys where I, uh, this last trip where I just did $100 per machine and tried out a bunch of new games um, that I've never played before, uh, like Conan and Kronos or Kronos. Not sure how you pronounce that. And Jumanji and, and the Jumanji game was just like playing in an arcade when you were a kid. It was it was uh, had a blast. Uh, casino in Atlantic City, staying at Caesars, and we'll be doing uh, group pulls at Borgata. Uh, no, Ginger's not coming. Sorry, scrolling through the chat here. Yep, we are all family. Mickey, I'm kind of new to YouTube, not sure uh, how to be a member. A lot of people have had trouble with this, especially if they're on Apple products. For some reason, Apple doesn't like uh, YouTube since it's Google, but uh, there should be a join button underneath the videos. If you, if you don't see that, you'll have to like uh, search on YouTube how to join a, mess uh, a membership from an iPhone. 
<laughs> ban ginger no no ginger's ginger's always welcome he just has a very busy life and very busy schedule so I, I teresa i've been trying to talk ginger into going everywhere with me so he's he's always welcome to go everywhere he's just uh ginger Ju uh jr is in baseball right now in season with a bunch of games and all that so his schedule is just super packed uh janice is like what's your favorite casino i've got a few uh, i mean i really like harris cherokee north carolina they have a, one of my favorite high limit rooms. They just, they won't let me film there, but I've hit a ton of jackpots there. Uh, Atomic, how did you get into gambling? My father actually kind of got me started. He was always uh, into gambling. Uh, no, I'll be, the group pools will be at Borgata, but I'll be playing at other casinos while I'm there. Uh, JJ, when you were in AC, do you call members participating in the group pool? Uh, Lucinda's going to be handling all that. She's my executive assistant. So, I mean, she's kind of like a one-man army. She does all kinds of stuff from getting the filming permissions to traveling with me and filming and uh, organizing these events, answering questions. Um, so she's handling all that. We'll be posting for the family group pool membership uh, level. We'll be posting in Discord for the family group pools in Discord. Uh, and worst case scenario, if we're missing somebody, we'll be calling the contact numbers. uh next fishing video probably soon now that the weather's warmed up that last one he made me do there was still ice on the on the water you're gonna move to vegas uh i'm back and forth whether it's gonna be vegas or florida i'm kind of looking at those two somewhere close to casinos and uh with a no income tax state like tennessee <clears throat> so thanks we'll appreciate you uh yeah i would definitely make a trip back to colorado penny All right, what else did we need to uh, discuss? There were several things I needed to go over. Randy, how do you fly with all that cash? I carry it with me. So I haven't had an issue yet, and but I've got all the W-2G uh, tax forms uh, to prove where the money came from. So, But you know, I'm always flying into or out of Vegas, so it wouldn't be that hard to uh, explain where the money came from. Uh, yes, Joe, in Washington State, any casino stops? Yeah, we'll be uh, playing at Northern Quest. That's one of his favorite casinos. Kami Topper, wife, girlfriend. Yeah, I'm going to clear all that up in this live, guys. Don't worry. So I did I did the last video, and uh, Livy was in the video, and we got all kinds of crazy comments, that, uh, 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 silly stuff. So we've got some new members of the channel that don't understand what's going on, so we'll clear all that up. <coughs> Uh, Carrie, I've been buying points in Arizona every year, so we're definitely going to do a trip. Be moving to Florida soon. I'll be going to Hard Rock Tampa to play slots. Any problems since you've had your gallbladder removed? No, actually, life, uh, quality of life has improved dramatically. So I don't get sick anymore. And I've been able to eat whatever I want to eat, Cat. It's it's been it's been amazing. So hi JD, just joined the Facebook family. When are you coming to California? Uh, within the next couple months. I'm still working the schedule out, but I'll be playing at Yamava. Uh, uh, any casinos any good to build bankroll for a beginner? Yeah, they can be. So yeah, they, they sure can. I when when playing on reservation casinos, I I tend to stick to the big name brand ones like Caesars, Harris. Uh, I, I don't, I haven't tried any of the little small off-brand names. Sorry guys, gotta scroll the chat here. Uh, did you win with Vegas Matt? Love his channel. Uh, I did hit a jackpot. Actually, him and I were doing little mini pools together, uh, playing Buffalo Gold. I think we were just putting 500 each in the machine. I did hit a jackpot. And then of course he jumped on video poker. So you can drink alcohol now. Yeah, it probably could, Nick, just not going to. Uh, $2 super chat from Deanna. Thank you. Uh, if your choice to play Black Diamond or Buffalo Revolution, which is your first option for a big win? For a big win, Buffalo. Uh, more frequent wins, Black Diamond. Thanks, John. I'm sitting right here in the backyard.
So yeah, guys, I actually uh, just finished all my taxes up and uh, I was talking to my CPAs and I'm trying to talk them into doing an interview uh, for all you guys to answer all the tax questions for jackpots and all that stuff. Uh, and they seem kind of open to it. So, uh, but the poor guys, you, you uh, it's very important you hang on to all those W2Gs because you do have to fill every single one of those out and claim every single one of those when you're filing taxes. So I felt so bad for my CPAs uh, but I was nice. I didn't just throw them all in a shoebox. I, I actually separated them all by state. So I took in a bunch of folders like this is Florida and this is Colorado and this is uh, Ohio and <laughs> this is Louisiana and this is Nevada. Um, so I was nice. But yeah, they had to they had to input all of that data from every single one of those WTGs I had last year. Uh, favorite Ainsworth must hit by slot. Uh, I, I've hit more jackpots on Thundercash than any of the other ones. So, uh, um, that one, uh, Grand Dragon is a lot of, is interesting. If, uh, you can get a lot of re-triggers, so that's, that's interesting. Uh, I did jump on an Ainsworth game here this last trip, and we hit like three jackpots or four jackpots. They were all small. I think I was doing $50 bets, and we were hitting $2,000 jackpots, $1,200, $1,400. Uh, but it was up to like 96000 so it was close to, uh, going off the 100000 must hit by. Uh, and the first jackpot hit was on Mustang Money to EJ. So, if you don't live in Nevada, should you have them take taxes out if you get a hand pay? So, great question, CJ. So, the way I'm going to answer that, since I just filed all the taxes here with the CPAs, is uh, guys, if you are a, a an occasional gambler, like every once in a while you may go two to three times a year type of deal and you hit a jackpot it's probably easier just to have them take the taxes out of the jackpot right then and there and then you don't have to worry about it you don't have anything to worry about uh if you gamble like i gamble and you, you you're hitting hundreds uh thousands of jackpots a year uh, then the best thing to do is just not have any taxes taken out of any of it and then file at the end of the year with your win-loss statements so you can get your win-loss statements from every property uh, I downloaded them all from Caesars and MGM properties and uh, Pen Play properties. Uh, downloaded them all right off the uh, off the sites and printed them all out, uh, and it covers all the properties. So everywhere I've played, uh, and you can write off any taxes that you owe. Uh, uh, you can your losses can cover all any tax liabilities that you owe up to your loss amount. So say you gambled a hundred thousand, but you lost two hundred thousand. You can't claim an extra hundred thousand as a tax write off. You can only claim uh, up to the hundred thousands that uh, you may have won uh, you're very welcome Corey do I have an all-time favorite casino uh, gosh there's there's quite a few that I really like I don't know if I have an all-time favorite I liked LaBerge and Lake Charles uh, I liked Harris Cherokee North Carolina they just won't let me film um, and uh it's 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 interesting in vegas because you, you can uh sometimes properties aren't hitting so like you know, we'll hit caesars and nothing is hitting and we'll go over to bellagio and everything's on fire and we're hitting everything or or vice versa we'll go to mgm grand or we'll go to you know somewhere else um this last trip we weren't hitting anything at uh bellagio uh it was really cooling down we weren't really hitting much and then we went right over to caesars and uh did, we didn't even film a lot of it but i think i had four machines uh locked down with jackpots in the high limit room with caesars three of them were dragon links and one was an ainsworth game and it was just we'd hit a jackpot i jump on another one put my card in we hit another jackpot i jump on another one put a card in we hit another jackpot so i had uh three million dollar dragon links locked up uh melinda i don't personally play lotto I got, except for every time the lotto gets big like powerball my father is is blowing up my phone on whatsapp sending me all kinds of stuff saying you know powerball's a billion dollars go buy tickets and then i'll go buy twenty dollars worth of powerball and donate twenty dollars just to make him happy where can i buy t-shirts jackpot judo on the website jackpot judo llc.com and then just click on merch nice jackpot on pinball daryl uh black line yes i have i have gambled on reservation casinos uh i've tried potawatomi i think that one was up in wisconsin 
I got my rear end handed to me there. Uh, and then I've played at Harris Cherokee, North Carolina, which is owned by the Cherokee tribe. Caesar, Southern Indiana, also owned by the uh, Cherokee tribe. Uh, uh, Pat, the hats are, are flex fit, so it runs small, medium, or medium, large, or the two sizes. Hello from New Mexico, Pearl. That's where my father was born. Uh, when am I coming back to Louisiana? Not sure yet. I've got so many travel plans uh, coming. Is your dad successful on slots? As you are not even close. So I'm gonna take I'm gonna take him out and school him. So average of bonus every session. I do like pinball. Uh, pinball has been rough this last couple trips to uh, Vegas, though. Uh, we couldn't get a pinball bonus to save our life. We tried a couple games. So really weird that uh, the videos that are coming out on the channel right now was uh, turned into a buffalo trip. Like all the buffaloes were just on fire. Hey, you want to grab Livy? So uh, the uh, you know Buffalo Gold Revolution and and Buffalo or uh, Buffalo Gold just uh, just ridiculous. We we're hitting so many jackpots on Buffalo Gold. It was just silly. Jason, do you see the pictures? Uh, people post their jackpots on the Facebook group. Yeah, I, I, I have a lot of catching up to do uh, on uh, Discord and Facebook to, to scroll through a lot. So, I, like I said, I just got back from Vegas. I was there for three days. And then I've got Atlantic City coming up next week. So, a lot of travel, but I, I, I definitely have to catch up on some socials. I have not been to Horseshoe in Indianapolis yet. So, Buffalo is hit and miss. Yeah. Hey, thanks, sweet. That was one insane buffalo. Yeah, AC was going to be uh, sick. We're going to have fun. So we've got all the permissions for the group pool in Atlantic City at Borgata. I mean, they're going to lock down a machine for us. They're going to let us film. They're going to, so, I mean, everybody's going to be able to get rowdy. Um, I have not been to uh, Wendover yet. So I uh, have not tried Clover Links in Cherokee. Uh, Florida, I think we're planning first week of June, guys. So, um, all right, guys. So the last video, I, I had Libby in the last video, and I got a bunch of questions and a bunch of comments, people thinking I got a divorce or I'm going through a midlife crisis or, or some stuff. So I want to clear this up real quick. Hey, babe, you want to come say hi to the judo family? So, guys, my lovely wife just got off of work. She's a CNA. So... This is my lovely wife. Say hi to all the judo family. Uh, babe, you want to come say hi to the judo family? <laughs> so, guys, this is Livy. This is our beautiful girlfriend. <laughs> so, she was in the last videos. So, wife, girlfriend. So, I did not get a divorce. It's not, it's not that complicated. <laughs> so, uh, they both work full time. And uh, sometimes, if they can, they'll both travel with me and play, like during Vega, uh, New Year's Eve. Uh, and sometimes, uh, like on the last trip, Libby came with me to Vegas uh, because she had the schedule and the time off. Uh, and and the lovely wifey here is coming to uh, Atlantic City. So uh, here at the end of the uh, next week. So hope that clears it up. I see we got a lot of new members that were asking questions. We had some crazy comments. Uh, someone was saying that you know I, I divorced my wife and got a girlfriend and I'm did I get a car with my midlife crisis and some other stuff. So this is uh, this has been. Uh, going on five years now so so yeah it uh, like I said it's not for everybody it works for us we all live together so it uh, we're all we're all adults and it's all about open honesty and communication and just it's just our situation so if you see me refer to a girlfriend in a video that's why wife in a video that's why it's it's not one or the other so thank you very much guys appreciate it So, no, I did not get a divorce. I did not get a new girlfriend. I did not get a new fancy car, and <laughs> I'm not going through a midlife crisis. <laughs> we got some crazy, crazy comments on the last video. Megan's son. I definitely want to play uh, Foxwoods. Uh, Megan's son, Foxwoods.
So thank you very much, Miss Trouble. My wife would divorce me if I got a girlfriend, Patty. <laughs> uh, favorite Red Bull? Original, Tina. So I've tried some of the flavors, but yeah, just, just an original flavor type of guy. So, uh, <laughs> Thunder is real, brother. <laughs> That's right. Girlfriend is actually a girlfriend, not just a friend. That's right. That's a YouTube channel by itself. Okay, I just wanted to clear things up, guys. I didn't want to make the whole live about <laughs> the, the living situation, but hopefully that uh, that clears up any of the confusion with some of the, the crazy comments that we were seeing. <clears throat> so, but yeah, guys, I hope uh, you like this. I'm thinking about doing a live every Thursday and uh, just to hang out, just answer any questions, hang out with the Judo family. Miss everybody out there uh, with, with all the uh, traveling temperatures. And it was in uh, low 80s today. It's right around mid 70s right now, John. It's really nice. Do you have any toys, cars, guns, etc.? Uh, yes. Toys, yes. Cars, yes. Guns, no. I lost all of my guns in a boating accident. Uh, I don't have a certain time that I like to play uh, uh, other than early mornings. I enjoy playing early in the mornings uh, because the casinos are not near as busy. So I've got my choice of games and I don't have to wait to get on a machine. Oh, thank you very much, Lillian. Uh, will I get better luck going to a local casino off strip or free run? No, Nick. Uh, that's a thing that's going around a lot, saying that the odds are better off strip and all that. I've never had an issue. Like I said, I just hit 62 jackpots uh, in three days on strip. Got to move here closer to the lights. It's getting it's getting dark out here now. Do you win more than you spend? Absolutely. So that's just part of being disciplined, and uh, I'll show you guys that. In the last video that's coming out from the three-day trip to Vegas, uh, so I'll show you the cash that I brought home and the the jackpot slips. Again, I, I cover all that in the last video. <laughs> Boating accident. So you're very welcome, Missy. It's a pleasure. So yeah, it's funny, Scott. It's those boats are dangerous. Uh, what part of Tennessee you're in? North Central. So I'm on Dale Hollow Lake. Yes, I like to go camping. Do you get picked for contest wins? No. So, uh, and I actually just played in my very first slot tournament. It was an invite at MGM Properties, a million dollar slot tournament, no entry fee. And that was kind of hard for me to get used to. It goes against everything in my nature because it's all about just smacking the button and, and tapping the screen everywhere. And, and I'm not a screen tapper or a button slapper. So, I mean, it was fun, but it was took some getting used to. Uh, Pat, yes, I still am in crypto. I'm still holding. Oh, thank you, Kisses from Canada. Appreciate it. Uh, Jack, any good place to gamble down Memphis? I don't know. I haven't been down there. <laughs> usually, Teresa, usually. So, Tracy, yep, still holding. So, that's one of the things about the crypto, guys, is everybody wants uh, crypto advice. There's lots of crypto influencers on YouTube, uh, and I'm not a financial advisor. I actually had to take that one video down because we've got so many people wanting uh, investment advice and uh, advised by attorneys. Like, you got to take that down. You're going to get yourself in big trouble. So, uh, I want to help everybody out there. I just can't. Uh, I just can't give investment advice. So, I can tell you what I'm doing, which is, you know, I, I still heavily into crypto, and I'm still holding. Uh, Northeast is coming soon, Dan. Uh, Celeste Cruises, thank you. That's one of the things I wanted to cover. Uh, any updates on a judo birthday party? Yes, it was your idea, actually. Uh, we're in the works of planning that right now. Lucinda's uh, in touch. We're going to do a judo birthday bash in August. So, uh, and we're working on all the details for that right now, talking to the host. Uh, it's going to be a whole, uh, we'll do a uh, birthday celebration slash group pool event. 
Uh, and it'll be a whole VIP event where they'll lock a machine down for us and lock uh, a dining hall down and, and serve a meal and cake and, and all that cool stuff. So still working out the, the details, Cindy, and we'll get it all posted for everybody in plenty of time in advance notice. Uh, so Solana at $20, great buy. So, uh, uh, Tracy, no, uh, I'm not worried about the XRP laws. That thing, they've been going through lawsuits for forever. So, can I DJ the party? Uh, it's fine with me, EJ. So, uh, but yeah, so we'll, uh, we'll have all the information and the details out once we get everything finalized, uh, well in advance for everybody. But it will be in Vegas and it will be in August. Uh, and we'll have uh, some books of rooms set aside for people that uh, need rooms. And like I said, we'll have a VIP uh, dinner, cake, and then we'll do a big group pool uh, for the group pool members. <laughs> Parachute in. <laughs> I wish I could, brother. So I'm, I'm just trying to uh, just trying to rest and recover. Every time I go to Vegas, I need about a week to recover. It's just no sleep. So you can see in some of those videos, uh, um, one of them it almost looked like I was stoned at the end of it. My eyes were so red, and it's just because we are going for so long uh, playing and, and filming for you guys. Uh, just tired. So... Uh, how do you participate in group pools? KFC, you just have to be a member of the group pool, uh, family group pools, and all that information is posted uh, for the group pools. So the ones in Atlantic City, we got a sign-up sheet, and it's uh, it's been out. It's been posted under community for the family group pool members to see it. And anybody that's interested in uh, being in the one of those group pools, just sign up. Uh, I wish you would put out videos more than once a week. That's We're working on it, Crushing. So we're going to get to two videos a week, and then three, and then a video a day. So that's the ultimate goal. We put out a video a day. So right now, we're going to, videos come out on Tuesdays, uh, and then I think I'm going to do these lives on Thursdays, just to hang out with everybody. So Tuesdays and Thursdays. <laughs> no comment, Jackpot. Uh, August 30th, another August birthday. Nice, Tracy. Plans for Pennsylvania? Yeah. So, uh... Livy and the, the, the girlfriend and the wife both have family in Pennsylvania. So one of these trips where they drive up to visit their family, I'll ride up there with them and I'll play in Pennsylvania. And I'll let everybody know when I'm going. Never had a bad Red Bull. <laughs> Reality TV show coming soon. Stop it, Livy. Uh, 100%, Patty. 100% will come out and play bingo with you. You ever hit a jackpot and they say the machine malfunction? Yes, this uh, they actually this did actually happen to me, Willie, and I've got it on video on the channel. <clears throat> and it was a uh, Ainsworth game, and I put some money in it. it. Was doing $50 spins, and within like four minutes, I hit the random must hit by progressive $9,600, and the whole machine froze and locked up. It flashed the Progressive on the screen, and then the whole machine just locked up and froze, and I had to hit the service button, and they had to come over and unplug the machine and plug it back in and restart it, and I thought there was going to be some issue and all that, but as soon as they restarted the machine, it popped right up on the screen, 9601, and they paid me out, so it wasn't an issue. You ever play table games? Nick, uh, I used to strictly play table games back in the day. That's all I used to ever play uh, was table games. Uh, back Caribbean Stud was my favorite, and I've had some crazy runs on Caribbean Stud. Uh, but I also like uh, three-card poker. I like Let It Ride. Um, but, you know, one big jackpot on a slot machine is pretty much all it took for me to, to turn around and realize, okay, uh, it, you know, the, the, the chance of hitting, you know, one of these big, big, it's just much better on slots than, than cards. Uh, unless you're playing something like Caribbean Stud where they've got the progressives for a straight flush, et cetera, et cetera. Um, but like I just hit that 660x jackpot on uh, Buffalo Gold Revolution on a $22 bet, and it was just a random line hit, $19,440. I mean, that's hard to do at a card table. Yeah, death. No, I've, I've drank a lot of Red Bull. I've never had a bad one yet. So I'm, I've cut it way back uh, since the gallbladder surgery. It, it, I hardly drink Red Bull at all when I'm home. But for some reason, when I'm in Vegas, that's it's we end up drinking a lot of Red Bull. So let's see, we covered the birthday bash. We've covered uh, some new items coming to the merch store. We've covered 
Uh, Judo Bowl will be drawn May 2nd. I heard you say you had camera to pot. I mean, you could not win. That's where we play. Nobody wins. So would you try a different casino? Uh, I don't know. I know Mr. Hampe went up there and he hit big jackpots at Potawatomi. I was up there on a work trip and I went in uh, and played and we didn't hit anything. I mean, nothing. And not only that, we noticed as uh, as we were leaving the place, we didn't hear any jackpots going off. We didn't see anybody winning anything. I'm sure they do. Um, but uh, I, I personally did not have any luck at Potawatomi. Do you like catfish? Sure. Ginger cooks uh, some mean catfish so I've been fishing with him or we've caught him right out of the river and then he he cooks and cleans them himself uh, EJ California trip not sure yet my father's coming in at the end of June I just know that we've got to visit California uh, to visit my grandfather and his father and we've got to visit Washington State to visit my sister so we'll be hitting Vegas California and Washington State uh, within the next couple months uh, Admiral Thank you for the super chat. Love the content. Quick question. How can I join the Judo Family Discord? Uh, check the community tab on the YouTube and look for the Discord link. I will uh, I'll post it again right after this live. I'll post another link to join the Discord. Uh, and that's absolutely free for, for all the members. I'll post it for the members. Just click that link, download Discord, and uh, it will put you right in the channels. So, death eater, exactly right. That 100%, that's exactly how I feel. So, you know, one and a half, uh, what is it, you win one and a half times your bet on a blackjack? So, I mean, you can have good runs on blackjack. I have. So, but you're never going to hit a crazy 660x jackpot, you know, like I just did on Buffalo. So, happy early birthday, Patricia. Good luck to you in Judo Bowl. Cook trout with the head on or off. Debate me and my husband. Uh, has so you guys are debating trout. I've done it both ways, Carrie. So uh, this last trip to Colorado, we caught a bunch of uh, rainbow trout, Ginger and I, and we cooked them with the head on right over the fire. Uh, we actually just ran sticks through the open mouths and we hung them over the fire. Uh, Oregon anytime. I'm, I'm sure Max. I just don't know when. So, but uh, I'll definitely be playing at Northern Quest when I come up to uh, to Washington State, and I'll post that uh, on the community tab for all the members. Uh, I'll post all my travel dates, guys. So Atlantic City's already posted. I've had that up, uh, posted, and then uh, well, when I'm going to Atlantic City and the group pool information, all the other stuff, and and as soon as I figure out where I'm going next, I'll get that posted too. So right now I'm planning on uh, Florida probably the first week of June. It's the same way McDonald's makes filet of fish, Chris. <laughs> yeah, I got to come down to Florida to play with Chris. Is there a better Buffalo game? What about Dragon Lake? Tracy, uh, I like Buffalo Gold Revolution, and I like Buffalo Gold. Um, just recently did a little bit of playing on Buffalo Chief this last trip. I, I'm planning on doing like a Buffalo comparison video where I go play all the different versions of Buffalo and compare them all to each other. Oh, Cindy, ouch. I had a crazy run at Caribbean Stud in um, in Louisiana. I'm trying to remember where the name of it. Baldridge, Louisiana, something like that. I forget the name of the casino. Playing Caribbean Stud, and uh, I took a 1,000 to play with. Uh, thanks for the su super chat, Sonia. And I was sitting at the table, and just once, I wanted to max bet just once. and I, So I put the ante at 500, and with Caribbean Stud, you get five cards, and it's just five card stud you get five cards the dealer gets five cards and you look at your hand and if you want to play you have to bet double whatever the ante is or you can fold them. so max bet was 500 dollars ante uh, and uh so it's 1500 on the back end or sorry a thousand on the back end 1500 hand and i got dealt a pair of twos <laughs> so it's like i can't believe i'm betting 1500 dollars on a pair of twos but i played a pair better at caribbean stud uh, and the dealer didn't qualify and paid me my $500 ante. So I did it again, and then I had two pair, which pays two to one odds. And it was just a crazy run from that on uh, that on out. I asked for a, a chip rack, and because uh, that's how many $100 chips I had. And I filled the whole rack and found out it holds $10,000 exactly, $100 chips. And that's what I ended up leaving that night with was ten grand. Nice, Ricky. Good job. U.S. Coast Guard. Very cool. Both my parents uh, met and married in the Coast Guard. So...
Uh, go off strip to Durango. I'll check it out. Uh, Alonzo, yeah, that's something we we've, we've discussed that that I might be interested in doing. Is uh, I mean, I'm willing to help anybody. I've done a lot of tried to help. I've done a few one on ones with the judo family that have been out when I've been out, and uh, uh, but a workshop may be the best way to do something that, like try to help a bunch of people at once. Welcome to the extended family, Rhonda. Uh, how does one get a lucky judo chip? Uh, right now, I hand them out in person. So I post where I'm going to play at for the family, and if you're in there, you come out, you get one. Hey, Paul. Hey, Mike. Good job. Good job, Jeremy. Congratulations. How many miles do you fly per year? Too many, Superman. <laughs> Way too many. So you now have seven days of Saturday and Sunday. It's nice, isn't it? That, that's probably the number one thing, Sherry, is uh, I get to sleep in now. So that uh, that alone is, is worth it. So still a lot of stress, making sure I have enough money to cover you know all the bills and my responsibilities are taken care of uh, and all that other stuff. But, uh, yeah, it's definitely a complete turnaround. Uh, Rudia, do you do racinos? I, tr I tried a couple of them in Kentucky. I did not like them. So because Kentucky can't have uh, class three slots in their constitution. Uh, but I did go play out there at a couple of their racinos. Uh, Mickey, are you resting before you go to the next day? Absolutely. So I've just been taking it easy. I got to get caught up on the socials, and then next week I'm on a flight uh, to AC. So I get in late at night, and then the next day, group pulls start. We're doing uh, one group pull a day, so we'll be doing three of them. Spirit Mountain Casino in Oregon. That'd be cool. Black line. Okay. If I make it to Oregon, I'll definitely check it out. John, what is the biggest jackpot you ever hit? You know, Libby was asking me these questions the other day, and I honestly can't remember. Uh, she asked me what the first jackpot, and I, I couldn't tell you the first jackpot I've ever hit. And Lucinda asked me the same thing. What was the first one I hit? And I, I honestly can't remember. The biggest one that I can remember was like 44 or 46,000 or something. I think it was on Dragon Link. Yeah, Washington State, Lottery Base. Uh, favorite slot, McKee. There's so many I enjoy. Uh, triple Stars is one of my all-time favorites. I've hit a lot of jackpots on Triple Stars. Double Diamond, Double Diamond Deluxe, hit a, you know, my favorite three reels. Hit a lot of uh, uh, jackpots on those. Uh, uh, volat high volatility games. I like Dragon Link. I like Buffalo. Uh, I really like the. I really enjoy the Buffalo music, like the Wild West music. Once you get into the bonus. Um, uh, uh, like Piggy Bankin, Huff and Puff, uh, love Cleopatra too for the crazy multipliers you can hit. Uh, massive one at Harris Pompano. Uh, yeah, Chris, uh, Harris Pompano Beach, Florida. I hit so many jackpots on Dragon Link that, uh, I decided I would just donate a thousand dollars back to the casino and I put a thousand dollars in and plan to do four $250 max bet spins. And the very first spin was like a $2,400 jackpot. And then I got the bonus to go off, and it was $12,750. Uh, and then right behind it, I got another bonus on $250 bet, and it was $17,500. So, I mean, back-to-back -back huge jackpots. Uh, just planning on putting $1,000 in and doing four $250 bets. Uh, not yet. Haven't been to Biloxi yet, Bobby, but planning on it for sure. Uh, Missy, wouldn't be surprised if IGT or another company approaches you asking you to make a slot game. That is the dream, Missy. That's actually one of my dreams. A jackpot judo slot machine uh, and collaborate on, on building a game with a scatter bonus and all that other cool stuff. Uh, Heidi, yeah, I did just play Heidi. It's going to be in a video that's coming out. It was the video I did where I was putting $100 in a bunch of different games, playing games I never played before. I have not played in uh, any Kansas City casinos. Hey, Eric. Welcome to the channel, brother. Without having the job as income, is playing the slots harder, or do you think they will be harder with higher bets? Uh, no, not necessarily. It's been the same. Oh, good job, Paul, on your uh, 3440 jackpot. Matt, what inspired you to start a YouTube channel? I uh, was never inspired, actually, to start a YouTube channel. Um, 
never planned to do a YouTube channel. I've covered this uh, a bunch of times. The uh, I would go out with friends and I would take some of my employees out as uh, team building exercises. After you know a long day at work, we'd go hit up a casino and all that, and they just would watch me win jackpots constantly. And uh, so uh, I had a couple guys saying, "You've got to start a YouTube channel and start getting this information out there." Uh, so I did, and the channel just took off, and it really surprised me. And now I'm having the time of my life just uh, filming what I do anyway, which was always a hobby of mine, which was gambling. So now I just get to go out and film uh, my gambling sessions and all that and, and talk to you guys while I do it and post the videos for you guys and read the comments and respond to the comments, and I'm just uh, uh, having an absolute blast. Are there any casinos you wouldn't go back to? Tina, great question. Yes, there is, and I'm trying to remember which one, but I don't want to badmouth anybody. Um, uh, the, the, the two that I went to Kentucky for sure, I'll never go back to again, uh, the racinos and I can't remember the names of them. Uh, but the one casino was really nasty. I was in there filming for you guys and, uh, they actually, uh, threatened to throw, drag me out is what they say. We'll drag you out of here. And I was like, no need for that. I'm gone. <laughs> and I made a video of that and I actually tossed my player's card in the trash and I'll never go back. Awesome, Fino. Good job. Uh, Vegas casinos you would avoid? Um, not yet. So uh, I've, I've hit jackpots in every one I've played in. So there's not a Vegas casino yet that I've played in that I said I wouldn't go back to. Next Vegas group poll, Gary. Not sure yet. Uh, it'll be this year. Uh, for sure, we'll do one for the birthday bash in August. Uh, one in Lake Charles that you didn't like. Missy, yes, that's right, the Golden Nugget. So the same thing. It had some uh, some floor guys. I don't know if they didn't know what they were doing, but usually you can film the Golden Nugget in Lake Charles. But uh, very rude individuals came over and and uh, chewed me out and told me I couldn't film. And that's when I went to Lake Charles right next door and made that first bankroll building video and killed it and then had a host walk over and introduce herself while I was playing live. So completely different experience at two casinos right next to each other. So what do you think about the Ellis Island Casino expansion? Slots to Cruise, I'm excited about it. So I've been talking to my hosts, and they've got a lot of big plans. So, uh, uh, Oak Grove. I live by that one. You were on Hats. Back. That's it, Oak Grove. Yep. Uh, Stan, same. So cruise ships follow the uh, same gambling rules and regulations as their home port. So, yeah, no worries, Gary. I hope you can make the next one. Mystic Lake in Minnesota. Uh, yeah, Myst Mystic Lake. I did okay at Mystic Lake. I had a, a really good run at Eagle Bucks. Um, but the one that I didn't do good there, I kept thinking it was Mystic Lake, and it's not. It was Treasure Island is uh, the one that I didn't do good on. So, guys, it's getting dark and it's getting late. We've been on here for an hour, so I'm going to go ahead and call it. I'm getting eaten up by the bugs out here in Tennessee. The weather's warming up. So, but uh, love all the judo family more than I could tell you guys. Appreciate you guys. I've got a lot of great content uh, that will be coming out. There'll be another video out Tuesday night. So, uh, yeah, thank you very much, Death. Yeah, Vegas Matt and I just had a conversation about that with uh, so many channels out there. And there's definitely some, some problem individuals out there. So, but uh, I appreciate all you guys more than I could possibly tell you. Uh, I've got a lot of exciting news of people that I've talked to, other other slot players, and uh, uh, things coming up, like Slotacon uh, for all the influencers, and uh, a lot of stuff that I can't talk about yet. But we got a lot of crazy, uh, exciting stuff in the works. Um, and then we'll keep this format, guys. We're all uh, videos come out on Tuesday, and I'll schedule a live uh, on Thursday. And uh, we're, if, if I'm not playing, I'm home. We'll just hang out and I'll answer questions and catch up with the judo family. If I'm out playing, I'll, uh, I'll live stream the play for you. So we'll have videos on Tuesdays and lives on Thursdays. Cat, when is your Vegas uh, mat? So uh, there's no actual video with Vegas Matt. So uh, we didn't do a collaboration or anything. He was super busy. He had tons of stuff going on. We just met and uh, over drinks. And we sat there and talked for like an hour. And then him and I just personally played out on the floor. So we didn't do any video filming or anything like that. So, uh, but anyway, guys, I appreciate the bugs are getting bigger. So, <laughs> guys, I, I appreciate you guys very, very much. And uh, next video will be out Tuesday. And uh, I'll keep responding to all the comments and everything, get caught up on the socials. And uh, hope everyone has a wonderful night. 
and I'll catch you guys on uh, the next live. And you'll see me next on the next video Tuesday. So everybody have a great night.